So I'm back with a fashion video today. I'm going to be doing a wardrobe must-haves for like the summer months. Just pretty much all of the things that I've been loving wearing recently that I've literally been living in this month. And I figured I might do these sort of seasonally or per occasion. So I hope you enjoy and we shall just begin. Yeah, there's absolutely no organisation to this whatsoever. I've literally just got a pile of all my favourite clothes here. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to get started. Okay, so first up, I've had these jeans for a while now. But I always want them out in summer just because they're literally like my go-to jeans in summer. So actually from Fashion Nova, and if any of you tried shopping on Fashion Nova and you aren't like used to the Fashion Nova sizing, I'm a size 5 in the jeans. Bear in mind I have like a size 8 waist and 34, 32, 34 inch leg length. So I typically get a size 5 because they're really quite stretchy so um, they get a little bit baggy which I prefer. Also I have quite a big bum thighs so yeah that was just a size reference but they are these really pale sort of light washed jeans and they've got this massive massive rip at like the knee they're like my summer jeans because they literally expose so much leg so absolutely been loving these i think the color is so flattering as well this is literally one of the most flattering shades of denim makes everyone's like butt look so good so uh, fashion over jeans 100% my favorite jeans hands down i've had this belt for a while but i have been literally using this religiously recently um so i think i got it from Rom i want to say Romwe uh a couple of years ago but they have these belts literally everywhere now like all of a sudden they just really come in and it's just sort of this big old like silver embossed buckle belt which is black faux leather been loving this i think it just looks so cool with any like plain outfit I actually bought this jacket recently and literally I don't know how I've lived without this in my life. I have been wanting one of these coloured leather jackets for a while because I live in my black one. I have a red one, like a dark red one that I love. And I saw this and I literally fell in love with it. So I got it from Stradivarius. It was about £26, which is a bargain for a faux leather jacket anyway. It had so many different colours. Um, Bershka did as well. They're all sort of very primary colours, very 80s. So there's like a bright red one, there's a cream one, there's like loads of different colours in at the moment. So if you're looking for a coloured leather jacket, definitely check out those shops. They're really quite affordable as well. Um, so absolutely love this. It's like a bright cobalt blue and I just think it's such a statement. Um, even in the summer, I stick to typically quite monochrome outfits. So that's been really fun to wear, just sort of with an all black outfit. I just think it looks so cool. And like I said, very 80s. I've been absolutely loving these new look jeans that I showed in the last haul that I did with um, the fraying at the bottom. Sorry, it's really hard to show. With just all the like fraying detail at the bottom, I just think they are so cool. Like I said, I typically stick to still quite simple monochrome outfits in the summer and this is just a great way to sort of make it a little bit different and experiment a little bit and I love it. So one of my favourite things is to wear these with um, like a black strappy, like just plain black top and then like my bright red trainers or that blue leather jacket. I love it, I just think they add something a little bit jazzier and they look quite expensive as well so I do love new look jeans. I honestly never thought I would actually like religiously love to wear a denim jacket just because I think they look nice but I think a lot of people have them. I showed this year in one of my hauls as well, it's the one with sort of like big old rips in the back and things and I love it. Again it's slightly different and denim jackets are great to wear in summer like I think you'll see them about quite a bit. I absolutely love this bleach sort of really light wash denim like I said with the jeans they are so flattering like this is so flattering as a colour and I just think it's so nice and oversized I've literally been loving wearing this and I think it looks really nice with like a plain white shirt dress or just anything really so this is literally like a love of mine. Next up is this top from New Look and this is very very bo boho bohemian style to what I'm used to it's like this really nice sort of rusty coppery colour and it's an off the shoulder bardo top it's got this sort of shirred um elastic across the front so it kind of sits there's a band across here with a frill above it and then it comes out in these sort of bell sleeves and it's kind of like flow peplum i think it is so flattering on anyone literally i've seen so many people wearing this sort of style top and i just think it looks flattering on everyone it really shapes like your waist and things and i just think the color is really nice as well it's still kind of summery but it isn't too like bright and out there because like i said i do still like sort of my simple colors and I'm a very autumnal fashion orientated girl, so I think this is like a really nice medium with the colour. As you guys know, I raved about this in my haul. Um, this is a faux suede brown uh, jacket from Miss Guided. 
I love this. I think one of my favourite things about this is that it's got like the silver detailing all over it. I'm so not used to wearing silver detailing things because every everywhere I go they just seem to have gold buttons, gold zips and everything and that's great if you wear loads of gold but I typically wear loads of silver and I absolutely love how like just cool toned brown this is. It goes with literally everything. I never used to think you could mix and match black and brown but this looks so good with again an all black outfit so i've been really having fun experimenting with this and it's really nice light material so that it's perfect to wear even in summer i'm talking about summer but i'm bearing in mind i'm talking about british summer so it isn't too hot Hors, i have to talk about this forever 21 bodysuit which again i showed in my haul i'm sorry it's probably like a repeat but i just want to stress how amazing these items are um this is from forever 21 it's about nine pounds and if you know me you will know how just how much i've worn this like like literally I need to buy a new one it is so flattering it's just a bodysuit plain black and I have literally worn this as much as I can with every outfit I literally look for any excuse to wear this so um, if you're looking for one of these sort of straight square neck bodysuits for everyone to have loads of different colours loads of different um, fabrics and textures and things so yeah I do finally I've rediscovered an old love for mine and this is um, I, it's an old shirt dress that I bought from Primark, I think it was in sort of autumn winter last year but I know they sort of have quite a few shirt dresses in. This is like a silky material, it's black and then on the back it's got this embroidery, it's just floral embroidery which makes it look a lot more expensive than it is. I do really like the embroidery trend but I just, I find it hard to find sort of like a nice medium between too much embroidery and not enough so I think this is a nice level for me because I don't really like it full on. Um, and this is really nice to wear as a dress itself, even though I'm quite tall, I've got a lot of leg as I always say, this is a really nice length. Or I've also been having fun sort of wearing it open with a little crop top and some jeans, or you can wear it sort of um, tied up like a shirt, a cropped shirt. It looks good so many ways, so this is fab, I love this. And like I said, you might not be able to find the exact one in Primark anymore because they've changed their stock so much but uh, they do have a lot of similar ones in at the moment. So those were all of my wardrobe must-haves, all my current like favourites for all clothing and things. Let me know what your guys' favourites are at the moment in terms of fashion trends and things. Um, I'm really struggling with summer trends, I'm just not a super summery outfit person, so this is sort of like my adaptation of summer trends and things that I like to wear when it's slightly sunnier. Let me know what other Wednesday videos you want me to do down below, that can be anything to do with fashion, beauty, uni, organisation, literally anything, I will try and do it because um, it's so much easier to take your guys' requests because I know you actually want to see the videos. Uh, yes, I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you guys on Sunday for another mystery video. Bye!